I, I want to welcome all of you all to the to Kef Barker. We're stepping back in time. 150 years ago, on this date, President Abraham Lincoln came to this camp to visit some residents. And so now, 150 years ago, many of us would have been runaway slaves coming in here from Maryland and Virginia. And we were sitting on this site because across Bar Street that way uh, was an army camp called Camp Barker. And if you're a runaway slave during the time of the Civil War, uh, when you finally find some freedom, you want to be located nearby to an army camp because the army was the police department for the federal government. And so we would all be sitting here someplace, uh, really be lined up as we were waiting on the president because we knew he was coming because we had been alerted by a person named Mary Dimes who was a resident here at this camp. And Mary Dines, like many of the people who lived here, worked for the federal government. Some of them worked on the military base across the street, but Mary Dines was fortunate enough to work at Soldier's Home, which was a few blocks up the street. And she worked up there, but she was a cook for President Lincoln. And you all know, for those of you in the audience who cook, I love to cook myself, but there are a lot of good reasons you like to cook. Because every once in a while, you get a little, put a little something extra in that pot when you get cooking, and the people who eat it, get it just like you wanted them to get it, right? Y'all know what I'm talking about? <laughs> so she probably put a little extra in President Lincoln's coffee, a little extra sugar in his tea, or broke one of them fingernails, 